Hey everyone and welcome to EdTech Hustle. Today I'm going to show you Microsoft Copilot. This is the ultimate AI assistant for your phone or any mobile device. Let's go ahead and get started. The first thing you're going to want to do is go to copilot.microsoft.com and you are going to want to sign up for a free account. After you sign up for your account, you can go to the App Store for iOS and Android and download Copilot. All right, so I just launched Copilot. You can see right in the middle of the screen, there's an option that you can turn on GPT-4, and this is basically the same model that ChatGPT uses. So Microsoft will allow you to access Copilot for free. This is going to work just like ChatGPT, but you have an easy way to access it from your phone. So a few things that you can do with it, it does give you some suggested topics to get you started. Let me just take this one, summarize the top and news and expand on one topic that's most important. Okay, so you can see that I've just been returned a number of different results from my individual prompt. Now, one of the things that I do like about Copilot is the fact that once it returns those results, it will also give you the source where that information comes from. So just a really nice feature that's there. Now, one of the things you can do is take the button to copy all of that text to the clipboard and I can paste it from one place to another. But let me go ahead and go back. Now, another thing you can do is actually use this to create an image. So I'm going to try this. I'm going to say, create an image of a flying reindeer over New York City. So what Copilot will do is use DALI to generate an image. So again, these are services that you typically have to subscribe to get full access, but you can get the same access using Copilot for free, which is again, just another great use for this. Here we go, we have a few different images of that reindeer flying over New York City. So a really great feature. Now, one of the things that I really like about this is the ability to use voice to text or speech to text. So if I just tap on my microphone, hey Bing, can you give me an idea of what the most popular topic would be to create a YouTube video for? Okay, so now you'll see in a second. Sure, I can help you with that. According, According to, the to the web search results, results some, some of the most popular, popular topics for YouTube, YouTube videos in 2024, 2024 are YouTube Shorts, short form content that displays vertical. So you get the idea. You can kind of do like almost like a Siri on steroids with Copilot. It's not as quick as a Siri is because it does have to go out to the internet to get the results. But if you just are willing to wait a couple seconds, it is a very powerful tool. Great speech to text feature. And also as you, as you probably heard, the narrator does seem lifelike. So it just makes it a little bit easier when you're not listening to a robotic AI voice. So the website is so the app is Copilot, your everyday AI companion. You can find it at copilot.microsoft.com. It is the freeway for you to access GPT-4.